Hey everyone, this is Engga Rizky from Indonesia and welcome back to my video in YouTube and good morning from Indonesia and it's already 12 after midnight and I cannot sleep normally so I think I want to create the video about the Android Studio for the XML to create the layout so here this is my latest work that you can see I create the splash screen and I create the character to select your character but here we only to create the choose character we don't create the splash screen so i will skip this screen and i will only focus on this section so you will be able to learn how to customize the progress bar use the android xml with the drawable okay well right now i will slicing the assets that you can use it for uh, to learn with me in this video so first i will select the background oh, sorry this one i will select the background this is the important and the button and the character and the title okay you come is the title which is my logo and for the strength or agility or love just let it go so we can easily customize this into drawable so let's try with me the actually <laughs> this is my first time to customize the progress bar but let's challenge together so here i will slashing i will export this yukami and character and pick now and the background so we're going to make exportable by 3x and going to the desktop to give the name assets and export okay and after that just choose the chara character and i'm going to save cool now just keep it the sketch because we need to re we need to find the hex code of the progress bar well just go to the asset to check all of this we have the background button character and this is a wall uh, this is the layout design okay now we're going to the android to create new studio project game profile enga you can put it, my name is enga to remember my name <laughs> and next next with the empty activity next and this is for the profile activity okay and finish well here we don't need any Jav language so goodbye and go to Aries to go to the style to remove this action bar and then go to the color to change the status bar color with our primary color background so we're going to the background and rectangle and copy this hex code and then we're going back to the Android to press our hex code and here we go pretty cool okay and right now we need to copy the assets without uh, it's not include the layout just for a wall of assets so we're going to drawable to paste the assets firstly i'm going to setting the background to drawable background okay now we got the background here this is pretty cool and then we're going to design to looking for the images view and going to images to drag and drop this image view and go to the title and go back to this sketch app and this is 70 uh, sorry 97 and 40 we're going to the text to setting and 39 but i think we need to make it to the center and don't forget to setting the margin top and once you already setting margin top you need to setting 32 it's okay cool now i'm going to change this id to title it's pretty simple uh, it's pretty important to make sure the id is correctly yeah we are ready to create the title now we're going to design to drag and drop again for the character wow it's too big and we need to change the width and size it's around 100 
42 and 144 so going to the text here okay okay and now I will scout type it fit center no maybe scale crop okay so we move here and setting the margin top is 32 yeah it's enough and I think the character is so small I think I will multiplication this number so maybe around 286 okay and this is maybe 288 oh yeah this is nice hmm what do you think is it so big i think so i think let's try with the let's take uh just undo first i will to undo i will make it around 200 and this is for a quantum oh no 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 this is 200 200 and uh 10 okay it's enough it's not really small and it's not really big i think and it's already center cool now after that i want to create the button first yeah the button is important so but firstly we need to change this id to chara which is the character and then we're going to create the button with the maybe the width and height is 156 uh, and 44 so here and 44 db and just change the background to drawable btn and we can make it to the bottom and change uh, setting the margin bottom maybe 40 db okay it's enough and we just need to create the customize the progress bar isn't it but this is the id we should to make the id first btn peak okay and after that i will create the progress bar here but firstly we need to create the text view isn't it so we need to create the text view and this is raw content sorry and the text should be string and the text color white and then text size mm, 22 okay and I want to make it bold with the style is bold ah no 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 it's not really cool <laughs> just make it normal okay and i will setting the margin top and the margin left so the margin left is around 30 okay and the margin top is around 12 okay it's enough and below of this text field we need to define the id first this is for the str strings and below of the str we need to create the progress bar a horizontal progress bar i don't know how to pronounce in the code but i remember the progress bar oh this one yeah we can drag and drop and looking for the progress bar or oh, this one just cut and setting below of the text view where is it str pb progress bar and just setting the progress oh that's one and we need to change the background to be white oh no no i mean the background of the progress 
So we should wait. We should customize it into the drawable. So I will create the drawable PB str. Sorry, str PB. And this is should be the uh, layer list. Okay. And then we need to setting the item with the Android ID. ID is background. Sorry. Well, here we gonna to setting the Android and ID and background. And after that, we need to setting the shape like this. And then I'm going to setting the solid with the color is let's say blue. Okay. Now after that we just need to go to the HTTP profile and looking for the progress and here progress drawable is str pb. Now as you can see there's the blue color and we should setting the width maybe the width is around 260 so to be here is layout width is 260 dp but i think it's too sm small maybe yeah it's enough i'm oh, sorry okay it's enough as you can see the background has changed to the blue but I want to make this background is not blue, it's this color as you can see here. So the color is, I think we can create the dummy content here, yeah, just for the dummy. And I will select this color and we got the cuts, we got the cuts, we got the cuts and we go back to emulator, sorry, we go back to Android. And here just, tara and tara, pretty cool. And we just need to set in the corner the radius of be 100 dp and oh I forget to cross it. Ta -da, ta -ta 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 -ta. And we should change this margin it's only 8 dp and we're going back to we're going back to strpb to setting the progress so Add some Android ID, Android progress, and we need to use the clip because we want to create this progress uh, above of this background. So here, just copy and paste, and you can change the color to be red color. and just go to here and the color should be red but it's not red we want to make it cool how to use how to make it cool so this is the first color which is the C0C13A and here we, we don't use solid color we use the gradient okay and the color is different start color and color and color is the second color okay and we're going back here and the angel should be 180 tada but yeah we should minus tada no 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 i think it's not 180 so as you uh, if you see the first color in the right so we should move this i think 90 no yeah i think i just want to change this color oh my god oops yeah just change this color and tada pretty cool isn't it <laughs> yeah 
ya yeah. this is pretty nice so this is for the strength and you can also repeat your uh, my steps for the another progress bar which is the agility and love well as you can see here i already to copy and paste the layout but the layout is bad <laughs> no it's not bad we just need to tidy up and you know so after you create the layout like this you just to click these stars okay and let's run again into the emulator and the layout everything is okay well very nice but the button the layout is not enough for the button so what we gonna do to make this yukami to the top or we need to resize again the character all right so let's do this here i think we should make it to be small but i'm not really sure if we make it small it's the design is good so i think the yukami we need to remove the margin top okay i think it's not remove just decrease maybe 10 dp is enough and the uh, margin of this button should be 20 no 30 oh yeah 25 it's enough let's try again into the emulator well this is the design very cool but yeah it's a little different for the layout i think this is the bigger size maybe if you want to try in the bigger size which is the nexus 5 it looks better like we do in the sketch okay so thank you very much for watching this video tutorial and i hope it useful for you don't forget to download the project and download the assets i will put the link into description on the my video so you can take a look and download it free for you so nice to meet you from indonesia and please leave leave your comment like and share it to your friend so see you in the next video goodbye